well, we do do other things as well, but this is probably the thing that we're best at. Like, I feel like music, personally, I feel music more chose me. Like, I, I haven't really got a choice in the matter. It's just like, uh, it's kind of like breathing, you know? I I don't know anything else, man. <laughs> I can't lie. All I know is music, man. Like, it, if I, I've had to think about it. Like, I, start, I, I used to draw. And every time I was drawing, I felt guilty that I wasn't doing music. I was wasting time not doing music. And I'm all right, I draw it. Like, I'm... I can, I can draw, do you know what I mean? Like, and then anything else. I was never really interested in anything else apart from music. So that's all I know, man, really. Long story short, just be basically just fans of each other's stuff. Uh, decided to make music just doing collaborations. Um, and we just kind of, you know, we bonded in the fact that we loved exactly the same music. So we spent a lot of time making music didn't really have a name for anything and then over the last you know few years kind of like just before we put out still standing we we pinned it down and was like yo let's 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 get let's get a name for ourselves and let's let's move on as a group you know we have been making music over the so a lot of the stuff off the story so far was made before we was children of Zeus so the stuff was just made as Tyler Daly and Connie Con or features or whatever it could have gone on his project it could have gone on mine but um you know as as it, as it happens that stuff just kind of stayed in the vault for us and and we, we when we kind of put it on soundcloud started getting a little bit of love and we just took it further man just went at it i think what people like about this is it isn't just music i think they feel like they're part of it do you know what i mean so a lot of people invested themselves in the journey of seeing us struggling, fed up with music, do you know what I mean? The frustrations of music, they saw all that because I put it out there, I was like, you know what? Yeah, I'm frustrated right now, this ain't going right, do you know what I mean? They, so they feel like they're, they've they seen it from the part of where it wasn't going right to the part where it seems to, like it now feels like it's in the direction of going right. So they, they I think people just bought into the fact they were like, I'm part of this. And they felt the same way as how we felt about it, do you know what I mean? When we were low, they was low with us. And when, when the high came and the album came out, they, I think they felt the same way, do you know what I mean? Yeah, man, same. Uh, yeah, but we just, for us, it was important for us to make something that we was happy with, first and foremost. Something that, if it worked or not, if people liked it or not, we would be happy. Next year, the next 10 years, we can look back and go, you know what? I'm proud of what we did there, man, regardless of who likes it. The, f the response has kind of been just a you know a massive bonus really any any anything else is just a bonus so like i don't i don't have to work to make money anymore which is always a nice thing i'm doing exactly what i want want to do do you know what i mean and the 12 year old 13 year old connie con is like that's exactly what you always wanted to do it only took you much longer than everyone else you know what i mean so so now i'm like i'm actually kind of living my dream but it just took a lot a lot longer do you know what i mean so yeah man we're, we're happy about it. I, I don't know what the response to it's like outside of the uk really i can't really gauge it but hopefully everyone who was in the crowd now knows some songs and will listen so that's 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 the plan do you know what i mean i don't mind if people don't know hopefully tomorrow they, they'll find out do you know what i mean but we just to be fair we just enjoy not being at home, man. Well, I do anyway. He like he, he's got kids, man. He wants to be back home. Do you know what I mean? But we like being in places we've never been to before. We've never been here before. Do you know what I mean? I, I've been here, but we've never been here before together. So it's nice to come and meet some new people, see some new places. If a few people want to come and listen to the music, that's the bonus side of it. Do you know what I mean? Like I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for music. So you know, it's nice, man. Yeah, man. Imagine doing the job you dream to do and getting paid to do it. Do you know what I mean? You don't have to work. This is my job. Like cat. I can't ask for anything better than that, you know? Big up to the label, man. First Word Records, uh, Ali and, and Bobba, the man, they put in the work and, you know, yeah, one sec, let me finish. <laughs> Man's trying to hug the mic. Yo, this ain't a set, you know? This ain't a, this ain't a DJ set. I know. No, I was just going to say, man, big up to the label because they're, they're not like a record label, you know? They're more like a family, like, when... When we hooked up with him, it wasn't based on anything we was doing. It was just the love for the music. So they trust in everything we they trust in everything we do. We trust in everything they do. It works perfectly for us, you know. I just want to reply to like what you said before. Like it doesn't seem like it's a record label behind us, kind of 
acts, but I think it's also quite a conscious thing that we don't want to push ourselves as being forced or being like anything that we're not because people enjoy the organic growth of it rather than pushing it in your face and shoving all types of stuff down your throat that you don't need. It's just that we don't want to do things that we're not about, do you know what I mean? It's just like, let's just fit, let it grow organically. We don't, want, we don't want to go like that and then go like that. We just want to just keep just steady, do you know what I mean? So if it doesn't look like there's a label, there is a label behind us, do you know what I mean? But we don't really do all the, like, what's the gimmicky stuff that's to like push music. It's just like, let's just make music. If people enjoy it, then they'll buy it, do you know what I mean? Uh, I just want to say, yo, thank you for all the support, man. F like, you, you're showing us mad love right now. Um, any places that we haven't got to yet, I'm hoping to get there as soon as. Um, please, please, myver the promoters and get us out there. That's all I really want to say. That's what I say. If you, like, just for whatever reason watching this and you've no idea who we are, our album's called Travel Light. And all I like is just for you to listen to it. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's at the very least, just listen to the album. If you like it, then share it with your people. If you love it, buy it. Um, but just listen to it first of all and foremost, you know what I mean? And thank you for supporting, man. Ah, uh, fuck Fila, man. I'm done with him. When I get back home, I'm burning all this shit, man. It, it, nah, fuck him, man. It's too, if, if Fila ever see this, right, and they want to sponsor us, fuck you. It, it, it's not about that, man. <laughs> They're too late, man. They're too late, innit? Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah, same. Bun Fila, man. Ha, ha, ha.